All right, traders, this is Forex Nelson. I'm back again today with another seven trades. Today's date is April the 27th, and I'm using my brand new Pip Trigger trading system. This uses uh, indicators on the top and on the bottom. This one has the Hull moving average. And of course, I have my standard regular four indicators down here at the bottom. This is the driving force of my super signal indicator. Now I added the super signal indicator about four months after I put together the pip trigger. So remember, if you want to get the super signal indicator, it comes in the easy trader trading system. You can get some more information about the different packages in the description right below this video. At six o'clock in the morning, New York time, right where this vertical line is, I'm in front of the computer going through a bunch of uh, instruments. And I'm also taking a look at my daily trade plan. Now here is the daily trade plan. This is uh, live. Um, the markets is moving. And as you can see, there's still lots of trades moving and happening right now, even in the afternoon. It's around two o'clock in the afternoon as I am doing this video. You must have some kind of a daily trade plan. And if you don't, well, that's probably a very good reason why you are failing. You must have some kind of a daily trade plan. Now, all the trades I've taken were buys. And some of them were around 9 o'clock this morning. I was late coming to the computer. And some of them were even at lunchtime, like around 12 o'clock here today. In other words, you can trade any time of the day and have some good results. Okay, so on this first trade, New Zealand took the trade had a trader asking me how you get these little cursors here all you got to do is click on any one of them and drag and drop it up and that's how if I did that right now this chart here would change to gold So I took the trade at this time. There was your buy signal back here. The hull was blue. The daily trade plan said to buy. Got in at this cursor right at the goal line and I closed it out here just being happy. Looks like with about uh, 42 pips and those 42 pips paid out $263. Okay, moving on to the next trade, which is gold. On this gold trade, it pays $10 for each tick. And looking at the money, this should be 29 ticks. Remember, all you got to do is left click, drag it up, drop it. And then you'll get those little cursors where you get in. It's blue in color because I bought it. If I sold it, it would be red. And this is where I closed out the trade. And I got the signal to buy. Hull was turning blue, blue, a lot of blue. Trading is easy when you have a good system. And let's see, I said 29. There it is right there. It's actually should be 29.4. That's close enough. Let's just go with the 29 ticks and that paid out $294. Moving right along to the next trade, which is the pound yen. Another one I wanted to be buying. There's your super signal uh, blue arrow. Let's drag and drop this up to get those little cursors. Said to buy, that's exactly what I did. And I closed it out as it was starting to do a pullback. Close it out here, just being happy with about uh, 
looks like 42 pips. That ended up paying out $313. Okay, let's move on to the next trade, the Dow Jones. Now this Dow Jones pays $5 on each tick. Let's drag and drop it this up to get those little cursors. Got in here, closed it out here. Had the buy signal here. Charts were looking great for going up. So it pays $5, so I took the money, divided it by five, and the calculator says it should be 108 ticks. There it is right there, 108 ticks, and that ended up paying out $540. Okay, let's move on to the next trade, which is the Russell. Now the Russell pays $10 for each tick. So looking at the money, this should be 74. Let's get those little cursors in here. As I mentioned, blue, because we bought. Got in here and I close it up up there, just being happy. Now, generally as a rule, I look at the charts and the totals down here. And once I have 200 or more pips and ticks, I'm happy and I just close out the trades and I'm done trading for the day. So let's see, 74. There it is, 74, you remove the last digit, so 74, and that ended up paying out $740. Moving on to the next trade is the S&P 500. This one pays $5 on each tick, so you just drag and drop this up. Everything was looking great for buying. There is my buy signal, another one back here, by the way. Got in, so I took the money, divided it by five, and the calculator says it should be 157. There it is right there, 157 ticks, and that ended up paying out $787. Okay, moving on to the next trade, which is the NASDAQ. Now this one, also looking great, great example of a great way to trade. It was a no-brainer to buy, actually. Daily trade plan, everything screaming to buy. There's your buy signal. Got another buy signal right here. This one pays $20 on each tick, so I divided, I took the money, divided by 20. Calculator says it should be 65. There it is right there. You remove the last two digits, so it's 65 ticks. That ended up paying out $1,300. The microphone sounds um, a little bit different today. It's because I'm away from home and I'm using my laptop. And um, I'm on a short vacation, if you want to call it that. And I figured, well, may as well get in front of the chart today, even though I was running late. And nothing wrong with making uh, some trades, making some money while you're taking a short vacation. It's one of the reasons why I got into trading over 18 years ago. Wanted to, trying to figure out a way that I can make money. And also combine that, uh, with some vacation time. Love it, you only need a couple, few hours a day, and then you have the rest of the day to go sightseeing. So another uh, great day of trading, using my pip trigger. I added up all the pips and the ticks and it came out to be 517. And all of those pips and ticks ended up paying out $4,238. So if your system's not producing like my pip trigger, well, I recommend you get your hands on it. And don't forget about the daily trade plan, a must have. Now, if you're interested or if you have any questions, all you gotta do is get in contact with me. Now, when you buy from me, I do give full support and without support, 
you will fail at trading. Now, once you're on my YouTube channel and you're looking at the video, all you got to do is look right below the video and you'll see this show more. Click on it. It ex opens it up. Now, I really do prefer Skype, so I made it really easy for you. All you got to do is click on this link and we will have Skype connection and through Skype screen sharing, um, I can answer your questions. Continue to read here. There's important four things that you need to succeed at trading. Now there's four different packages. I do charge $250 each. I recommend buying all four packages. Now the training videos are in package one, the PIP trigger and PIP and how I trade live advanced trading tips. There's a lot of videos, 22 in this one, 20 in this one. Keep in mind the pip trigger does not include the super signal indicator. You, that comes in the third package here. And of course, um, as I mentioned, a must have is the daily trade plan. And um, if you scroll down, I show each package and exactly what you get in each package. There you go. And of course, you can either call, email, or Skype me. And as I mentioned, I prefer Skype. Here's all my information right here. And of course, I do have a special offer. If you buy two packages, I'll give you one of the other two for free. Keep in mind, you have to buy the two packages at the same time to get the one package for free. So it's just about time to wrap up this video. And of course, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. So until the next video, I want to wish you good luck with your trading and remember to keep yourself and your family safe. Okay, bye for now.